Boy, we're getting a lot of great questions on the website, and here's one I'll cover right now from Mark in LaGrange, Texas. He says, we have seen several bucks remain in velvet throughout the season. What is causing this, and what should we do in terms of herd management? Well, that's, that's one we get reported on a lot, but it's in a very small area of Texas, and it's pretty much restricted to Texas. Uh, it's, it's a, we think it's a chemical contaminant that's out there in, in certain species of native plants that just bloom periodically and the deer eat them. And essentially what it has is it has a castration effect on the deer and uh, reduces their sperm production and some of them are, uh, do not even have testicles descended. So that, with that effect, essentially what you're dealing with is, is a, a neutered buck out there and he's not gonna uh, ever strip his velvet. He's gonna continue to grow his antlers and when he hits cold weather, the antlers are gonna get frozen and they're, then they're gonna grow some more and they're really not pleasant to look at when you see one that's three or four years old and has been in this condition. They'll never breed. Uh, at best, they'll make, they can make pretty good venison, but, but uh, that's usually the reason for velvet antlers, antlered bucks late in the year.